Come and sit down, please, lad. Sit down? Yeah, I'm not having you there in my <laughs> line. Can't stand here, then? You can stand there. All right, I'm John Bones. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm Calvin Phillips. <laughs> Hi, I'm Calvin Phillips. Hi, I'm John Stones, and this is E and brings you closer to Manchester City. Are you going first, John, or me? Go on, you go first. Right, Edward from the United Kingdom. How does it feel to have a fellow Yorkshire man on the team? Brilliant. Brilliant, Edward. <laughs> what is that? It? Yeah. Simple. Brilliant. No, I'm buzzing. Nanaldo from Ghana. How did it feel to sign for City? Um, yeah, obviously, an unbelievable feeling. Uh, the best team in England and in the world, in my opinion. So, yeah, it was an honour to sign for Manchester City. Maya, Maja from Denmark. If you could possess a quality or, or skill that I have, what would you choose and why? <laughs> I'm going to have to say to laugh in any situation. <laughs> he's always laughing, he's always happy. I think that's a very good skill to have. Jeffrey from Australia, from your teammates, name a player who has helped you settle in the most, inspired you the most in training, made you laugh the most. Helps me settle in the most was probably the Yorkshire boys, John and Kyle. I think it's just because we have that Yorkshire connection, so. Um, I like that. And then inspired you the most in training. I'd probably say Erling, because he came in around the same time as me. Yeah. And obviously, I didn't expect to start as soon as I got here, but Erling started and played nearly every game, so. Who made you laugh the most? Uh, John Stones. <laughs> <laughs> John's the biggest joke in the team, so I'd say John. Salim, from Egypt. Who makes the best Yorkshire puddings? Ah, me and you. We can make it between me and you if you want. No, 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 I'm not going to do that. I don't want to embarrass you on. How do you make it then? I don't know how to make it. Exactly. It's just pancake mix, isn't it, really? But yeah, but you can't use pancakes, can you? you no, can't you can't use, use pancakes, a, but got, pancake what, mix. What ingredients is it? Is it just egg and flour? Mm. And there's your answer, eggs. Celine. Eggs, eggs, flour and... Butter. No. Mm. No? That must be a Leeds How do you thing. make it then? It's not a Leeds thing. No, you've justified what's gone on there, so... Salim, there's your answer, big fella. <laughs> Eamon, United Kingdom. What advice would you give to your 18-year-old self? Have more fun, probably. Not, don't, not take to everything so serious. It's a good one. Not, not, as, not serious in the way of like, not, not like when you're training, mm. but away from football. Yeah. Definitely. Ian from the UK. What is your favourite type of tea? It's a simple, it's a simple one. Type of tea? Tea. Yorkshire tea. It's Yorkshire tea. It's got to be Yorkshire tea <laughs> every day. Do you have one every day? I have a tea every day. Do yeah. you? Yeah, when I get home. Every day. Do you? Didn't mm. know that. Now you do. Jake from the United Kingdom. What is your favourite holiday destination? I'm going to say Ibiza. Has to be a beef. Easy one. Yeah. Easy, Easy one for John. Love Ibiza. A ref from Jordan, yeah. Where did you enjoy going more, Whitby or Scarborough? I'd probably say Scarborough. Would I don't you? Think I went, yeah, I don't think I went to Whitby that much. Did you not? No, nah, it was always Filey or Scarborough I went to. Mine was Whitby. Was it? Yeah. I'd, yeah, I'd have to say. They're both good, but. Yeah, I'd have to say Scarborough. Scarborough, okay. Yeah. Sinetta from the United Kingdom. What do you love to do the most outside of football? Nothing. Nothing. Just relax. Nothing. Just be with family. Yeah. Not well. Not nothing, but just chill. Yeah, just chilling out, traveling that much, and mm. playing much, so many games, aren't we? So yeah, I have to say that. Davide from Italy. What do you admire the most about each other's style of play? I admire how comfortable John is on the ball for a centre back. I can remember playing against him. Sometimes. No, most of the time. <laughs> I can remember playing against him for Leeds um, at the Etihad, and I can remember chasing after John for probably 80 minutes of the, <laughs> 80 minutes of the game. And he, I couldn't get the ball off him, so yeah, I'd say 
his composure and confidence on the ball. Easy for me this for Calvin. Easily his, his, his uh, range of passing and how he is always in the right place on the pitch. His positioning and some of the passes he plays, yeah, outrageous. So I'd have to say that. Cheers, John. Welcome. David from Belgium. Well, David from Belgium. <laughs> <laughs> when you faced each other in a game in the past, what were your thoughts and do you recall any challenges between each other? Exactly that. Yeah. Stay away from Calvin. <laughs> <laughs> Mine was more trying to get close to John, which I couldn't. So. Mine was stay away from Calvin. <laughs> I don't want my ankles taken off. <laughs> <laughs> Only because, I only say that because we have a little, we, we joke about before training or in training where <laughs> the ball's a bit loose. <laughs> We're going to smash each other, but no, I've, I've seen him do it. He came on against... Uh, Dortmund. Yeah, Dortmund. I think, what, was it your first, like, kind of involvement in the game? Mm. And he's, he's absolutely levered someone. I can't remember who it was, but I thought, yeah, this, this guy's up for it <laughs> straight away. No, <laughs> so yeah. Stay away from Calv. <laughs> Ro from Indonesia. I, I apologise if I've pronounced your name wrong for a start. But growing up, Calvin, what drills did you do to improve your game? I wouldn't say there were drills. It was just a lot, I did a lot of running to get fitter because I want that fit as a kid. So I did a lot of running and a lot of fitness to improve my fitness and my running attributes. So uh, Khalil, Khalil from the UAE. We love your dance moves in the dressing room and on the pitch. Where do they come from? <laughs> I don't know where they come from. My, my, the ones on the pitch that you'll see are kind of from my, my friend. He's always doing stupid stuff and <laughs> kind of just get them from him. Yeah, the little row one was from him. <laughs> <laughs> Can't show you on here. Um, so yeah, that was kind of, they were always telling me like, if I score, I need to do it as a celebration and I haven't, it's kind of stuck with me. Sleeping with socks on or off? Socks off, 100%. <laughs> if you sleep with socks on, there's somewhat serious. Bernardo does. There's somewhat serious. Uh, is that because he's got bad feet or what? Yeah, he doesn't take them things off. And it's then, somewhat seriously wrong if you sleep with socks on. Guy from Canada. What has been your favourite moment as a City player? I'm going to have to say two or three, but first, probably first trophy, first Premier League, and then arguably the last Premier League as well for how we won it. Yeah. And then I've, I've seen this one a lot recently. Toilet paper over or under? So you know you've got your toilet paper like that. Yeah. It, is it coming this way so you can pull it, or is it going that way so you can pull it? Do you get what I mean? Mine's under. Under? Yeah. Why? I don't know, it's just, well... It, Would you, are you bothered or is no, it have to be, be that way? I won't be, no, it's not something that I, I'd say that I'd need it to be over or under. It's just... Because I can't imagine you changing toilet paper <laughs> very often. <laughs> nah, Do you know no what I mean? Chance, no chance. <laughs> but I, at the minute it's under. Yeah, at the minute, right. from what I can recall, it's under. 